Hey, what's up? Welcome to today's Beer Me Out Brewcast. I'm Nick, and today's beer of the day is Stone Smoke Porter with Vanilla Bean, which I'll dive into in just a bit. Right now, let's get to the new releases. Tampa, Florida's Cigar City posted this picture to their Facebook page announcing the release of their fall seasonal brew, Good Gourd. This 8.5% Imperial Pumpkin Ale is available on tap and in Bombers at their tap room now, and it'll hit distribution shortly. Personally, I love pumpkin beers. This one sounds awesome, so I've got my friend from Florida on the hunt for it right now. If you're in Chicago, be on the lookout for Goose Island's newest Fulton and Wood beer, Grand Goose. It's a Scandinavian-inspired beer with Colorado spruce tips and lingonberries, giving it a piney aroma with a hint of melon. Grand Goose is only available on draft and in Chicago. Now, time for Brewery News. Colorado's New Belgium Brewing is kicking off its entry into my home state of Michigan on August 27th with a pair of collaborative beers with Brewery Vivant of Grand Rapids, Michigan. The pair will start with a Belgian amber brewed in Grand Rapids called Escafir. Now the second beer recipe is still in the works, but we know for sure that it'll be brewed in Fort Collins, Colorado, and it'll be released sometime in November. Bell's Oktoberfest will only be available on tap this year. Due to the logistics of moving their brew house to a new location in Comstock, Michigan, and the lengthy fermentation process required for their Oktoberfest, they were not able to brew enough beer for both a bottle and a draft release. On to beer events. Speaking of Oktoberfest, tickets are now available for the Sam Adams Oktoberfest at Park Plaza Castle in Boston. The event ironically runs September 21st and 22nd and celebrates the release of Sam Adams Oktoberfest brew. The event will feature beer, music, and much more. Tickets can be purchased now at showclicks.com. All right, let's drink. Today's beer is Stone Smoke Porter with Vanilla Bean. Now, I've had the regular smoke porter from them before, but I'm a sucker for anything vanilla. So when I saw this, I had to scoop one up. The special release is said to mix vanilla beans from Madagascar with chocolate and malty flavors to create a complex but not too sweet brew. ABV is 5.9, so let's give it a try. It's got a great nose on it. A good mix of... Uh, smoke and sweetness. I'd say a little bit more smoke, not too sweet. Overall, a really good beer. Um, I think I'll enjoy this after the show. So as always, I'll leave you guys with uh, the latest of today's Beer Inc. and I'll say cheers.